Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to create folders in Gmail. It's a show off be pretty straightforward, and without further ado, let's jump right into it. So let's say the first folder we want to make, I'm going to put my first email that I want to include in it. So I'm going to just check mark inside the box next to that first email. And then you want to go up and left click on the folder button right up at the top. So left click on the move to, which is what comes up when you hover over the folder icon. Left click on create new. So now it will ask please enter a new label name. So you can do whatever you want. And if you check mark inside the box here, next label under. If there are any other labels listed in here, you could list them. But since this is the first one, we're going to just order it as the first one. You don't have much of a choice when it's the first one here. So now you can see I have a new label, so invitations. And if you wanted to color code them, you're welcome to do that as well. So just left click the little arrow next to the label right here. As you can see on the left side, and then label color. Highlight over that, then you can select whatever label color you want here. You could also add a custom color using different codes. You could also add a custom color. So definitely pretty neat. And you can see I now have a new label for that. So now if I wanted to move another email to the invitations folder I created, just select it. And then I go up to the move to folder. And then I'm going to move it to invitations. Let's say I wanted to make another one here. Just go up to more. I just go over to the new email. Just check more next to it. Go up to the move to. Create new. And now I can name it whatever I want. So I'm going to say time. And then if I check mark nest label under, I can select to move it underneath the previous one that we created. I'm going to select create. So basically what that's going to do is it'll create a subfolder under it. Otherwise, if you did not want to do that, just don't check the box. It'll create a separate entry for it. So again, I did a different color for that one. So pretty straightforward, guys. I do hope I was able to help you out. And I look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.